What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Aries, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for sign of Aries for August of 2022. This can resonate if you have Aries in any aspects of your charts, sun, moon, rising, Venus, or no moon, energy of your charts. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. It doesn't apply that apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the minutes to do to resonate with the rest. It's free general place of reading for Sana Aries. I encourage everybody to check out their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node uh, signs for additional message or messages. Um, just saying, just saying. And if you think anyone else would like my channel, please feel free to share it via public media, uh, public media, social media, and word of mouth. I very much appreciate it. Love you guys. If you'd like to donate, type your sister 05. The link's in the search box below. I did receive one channel message as I was meditating on your energy. For August of 2022, I heard a major betrayal coming. So you plug it in, how it resonates. I think this is what somebody doesn't want you to know. Because this is uh, truth hidden. This is what somebody doesn't want you to know. It could be anybody, a friend, a neighbor, a co-worker, friend of me, ex-lover, etc., etc., etc. A major betrayal coming. So I think somebody's about to betray you, Aries. So, um, whoever this person is and how that applies. And we have trickery. Yeah, betrayal energy. Major, I heard major betrayal. So, you plug it in how it resonates, okay? Target a goal-oriented person. So, uh, tankard, celebration, fun, enjoyment. And then trickery. This is I feel this is a major betrayal energy coming. Target a goal-oriented person. And Aries really missed an opportunity with a very well-organized, very goal-oriented person. Huge opportunity lost here. Okay, this is what somebody doesn't want you to know. Um, if this resonates for you, I heard you missed a huge opportunity with a very goal-oriented, goal organized um, person. So whoever this person is, uh, it sounds like it's already a missed opportunity. Um, they're very well organized. They're very goal, goal, goal oriented. They have lots of desire, drive, and motivation. Um, and it's a missed opportunity there. This person, I think it's a person of your past. You plug it in how it resonates. Aries. Hospital ratings are going to continue to tank in a huge way. Hospital ratings are going to continue to tank in a huge way, and this is what somebody doesn't want you to know. Some kind of hospital ratings are going to continue to tank in a huge way. So um, I feel for some of you could work at a hospital or um, be connected to somebody that works at a hospital, or it could be a hospital you're about to visit. Uh, how that resonates and applies in your life, Aries. Some kind of hospital ratings are going to continue to tank. So um, the hospital has a goal um, to keep their ratings high, keep their um, public image high, to keep their um, their reputation high. But it sounds like it's the, it, it's tanking and it's going to continue to tank. So no goal met there. This is well, and it doesn't sound like it's going to continue to be met. This is what somebody doesn't want you to know. I feel for some, you could work in a corporate co conglomerate with this um, hospital or be a manager, boss, supervisor, or CEO in this hospital or going to purvey service or services from this hospital. Whatever hospital this is and how that resonates, tankard, celebration, fun, and enjoyment. Someone's about to be invited out on a date soon. Okay, someone's about to be invited out on a date on a date soon. So this is date energy. This is what somebody doesn't want you to know. I feel maybe you could have wanted to date this person or go out with this person or what have you, what have you. But it sounds like somebody else is about to invite this person out. Now, whether they choose, free willingly choose to go out on a date with this person, if they accept the date, a date or not, that is their free will choice. But I feel for a lot of you guys, you wanted to ask this person out on a date is what I'm feeling. Um, but 
it did not, you did not do it. You chose not to do it or something in life happened to where they moved away or you moved away or something. But it sounds like somebody is about to ask this person out. And a very significant karaoke time in a karaoke bar is about to be very significant. It's going to be a blast and you're not going to be a part of it. And a very significant time at a karaoke bar is about to become very significant. Um, I heard you're not going to be a part of it. Um, it's so, this is what somebody doesn't want you to know. Somebody's about to go out. <coughs> Excuse me. Somebody's about to get invited out on a date. It could be the same person that's about to go to this karaoke bar or somebody else. But somebody's about to go out and have fun. Um. I think you missed an opportunity with somebody there, Aries, that you wanted to date. It's exactly what I feel for a lot of you guys. And I'm just being for real, um, if the message applies for you. But some kind of karaoke bar energy. You're not going to be a part of it. It sounds like somebody, I mean, somebody else is going to be. I think for some, you're going to hear about it. You might hear about it from the gossip train, or you might see pictures on social media, or what have you, what have you. But um, I heard you're not going to be a part of it. This is the karaoke bar energy. They're going to be celebrating, having fun and enjoyment at the karaoke bar. I heard it's going to be a blast. Uh, but some reason you're not, you're not going to be a part of it. Trickery. A cancer is a huge ass snake. You're about to learn this. A cancer is a huge ass snake. You're about to learn this. So some kind of cancer and energy. They can have cancer in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, world, moon, and haven, Jupiter charts. I heard they're a huge ass snake. Um, you're about to learn this. So I feel for some, they, that could be the major betrayal for some of you guys. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. And a Libra. And a Libra. A Cancer and a Libra. Huge ass snakes. For some, you're about to learn they're huge ass snakes. Um, I feel they could be the one that's about to majorly betray you or they already have. They could have Cancer or Libra in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Nome, and Haven, Jupiter charts. Mask or Fem, Cancer or Libra. You plug it in, how it resonates, Aries. And for one, your child is about to betray you. One, a minor child, one, an adult child, young adult child with an old man in his 30s or some, for some in his 40s. Oh, my God. Whoa. Yikes. <laughs> You plug it in, how it resonates. For some, it's your child. For some, um, it's your minor child. For some, it's your adult child. They're about to trick and betray you. Uh, I feel this is a sexual relationship or a intimate relationship or a um, something more relationship. Some kind of either strictly sexual or hard string related relationship. Um, some with a man. I heard a man. A man in his 30s and a man in his 40s. Some it's a man in their 30s, some a man in their 40s, but your child is either a masculine or femme child, um, and they're either a minor child or a young adult child, and they're about to basically either run off with this man in his 30s or run off with a man in his 40s, or have sexual relationships with a man in his 30s or sexual relationships with a man in his 40s. Um, I think they're going to lie to you and trick and betray you and tell you basically they didn't... Um, they're not doing it. They have never done it. But in all reality, they're doing it or about to do it. Uh, it's a man in his 30s or a man in his 40s. If my kid did that, I would be off, flipping off the damn roof. And that's just the truth. <laughs> if either of my kids did that, I have teenagers, 15 and 16 year olds. There's no way. Uh, oh, my God. 
But I've raised them to, I mean, you can raise and raise and raise a child to, to have morals, ethics, integrities, and values, but whether they choose to act upon them or not is their free will and choice too. Oh! In an Aries is about to learn a secret at a family reunion. Okay, and this is what somebody doesn't want you, want you to know. You're about to learn a secret at a family reunion. So somebody has tricked and betrayed and lied to you. You're about to learn some kind of secret at a family reunion. So you plug it in how it resonates. I hope this helped. Love you so much. Namaste.